The enemy is counting on you to be distracted. He's counting on you to stay off focus. He's counting on you and me to be consumed with what's consuming the consuming the world today. They're consumed with politics. They're consumed with war. They're consumed with who likes this one, who likes that one, who doesn't like this one, who's wearing this, what type of that. They're consumed with everything. But we got to be like Mary. Jesus said, Martha, Martha, you consumed with a whole lot of stuff. You distracted with a whole lot of things. But Mary, oh Mary has chosen the better part. Mary has chosen what's better to sit at his feet. Oh, hallelujah. And hear the teaching and the voice of the Lord. Oh, bless his name. Hallelujah. He said that won't be taken from her. See, heaven and earth going to pass away, but this won't be taken. His word will not be taken from us. So we got to stay focused. Turn off the TV. Turn, turn it off. He said these things going to happen. He said, we're going to have wars. We're going to have rumors of wars. He said, we're going to have pestilence. We're going to have plagues. We're going to have earthquakes in diverse places. There's going to be floods. There's going to be hurricanes. There's going to be many things. But where is your soul anchored? Hallelujah. Where is our soul? Our soul must be anchored in him. If I start focusing on the world, I'm going to be like a ship. Tossed and driven by every wave of thing happening in the world today. But if my soul is anchored in him, I'm going to have peace. Oh, hallelujah. I'm going to sleep good every night, just like I do right now. I'm going to know that he's holding me in the palm of his hand and nothing can hurt me. So do like Mary. Choose the better part and let your soul be anchored in the Lord.